you can then see all of the different food items that the hosts have created, recipes and things. And I have a great touchdown chili dip mm. that people can find. And if you follow me on Instagram on Jill Bauer QVC, I posted my pep in a blanket. Ooh. Pepperoni and cheese rolled Ooh. up instead of your hot oh, my dogs husband would love that. with a little nice. pizza sauce to dip it in. So you can mm -hmm. check that out on Instagram on Jill Bauer QVC. All right, that is shameless self-promotion. <laughs> um, let's talk about our next item from Plow and Hearth. And Nancy Brandmuller's back with us. Hello again. And you Hi, were Jill. telling me, Nancy, I mean, you've seen every item from Plow and Hearth. Yes. You said you absolutely love this. I love this I item. I can see why. Tell yeah. us all about I it. I love this item. So Plow and Hearth is a company out of Madison, Virginia that creates so many products to help you add warmth and welcome to your home and very often they're artistic products that remind me of those jury craft shows yes this is one of them this wall art that is called the heart tree wall art because the tree itself it's sort of like a linden tree but that you'll notice that the leaves are all heart shaped Love it. and you'll notice two sweet birds in there like they're little lovebirds this is such Cute. a beautiful piece it's got copper and it's got um, variegated kind of um, sponge painted leaves it's very substantial it reminds me of the tree of life yes um, the size of this is 32 inches high so top to bottom mm -hmm. 29 and inches across. We have this on a pre-season sale price of $49.98. May I also tell you it is customer top rated. Yes, so I'm So people not who got it at home mm -hmm. absolutely love it. If you have a place on the side of your house, great. I would use this indoors as yes. much as I would use it outdoors, mm -hmm. frankly. Um, I think you probably have those bare areas where they could you, you could use something interesting. Many of you don't mount your televisions over your fireplace mantle. Wouldn't it be beautiful to do this as the centerpiece? Oh, Instead of a wreath, you have this beautiful tree. Um, definitely something I can use outside. Do I need to treat it in no. any way? You don't have to worry about it. Um, if you live in one of those harsh climates where you really are going to be concerned concerned about it year after year, you might apply a spray coating, but really Plow and Hearth makes sure that it's something that, you know, pretty much can stay outside and you don't have to worry about it. This is something that it's just such a statement piece. Yeah. I want you to see all the details. We were starting to look kind of at the trunk right here. Yeah. This has more of kind of like a coppery bronze like and hammered. Yeah. And it's hammered. That's the trunk and you'll notice that kind of same color goes through all of the branches. But then the leaves, you've got um, embossing on that. You have sponge painting you have just kind of an ombre effect so it almost looks kind of like fall leaves but not really mm -hmm. they're just colorful and beautiful and then as you go up on the branch I love the plow and hearth added just a couple of darling birds yeah. just kind of a surprise you don't really notice them when you first look at the tree yeah then all of a sudden it's like it's like oh there they oh, are there's some bluebirds in there they're so charming so this is actually something that I put up in my home um, kind of in this corner where I put a lot of potted plants. So I winter mm -hmm. over my hibiscus from the summer and my lantana trees from Cottage Farms. And then I have some of my other uh, plants. So I have this up in that corner. Nice. People are we're sharing some of the reviews over from uh, QVC.com. This piece is very well made and hangs in our living room. Very impressed and received several comments on the tree. Thank you, Plow and Hearth and QVC. So that's a nice five-star review. I mean, this is one of those items where I think, you know, you might look at it on television and think, well, but is it going to be flimsy when I get it home? Is it still going to be, you know, substantial? Is it really what it's going to be at home, what I think I see on television? And I think the five-star reviews sort of validate the fact that it really is. Um, this piece is a showstopper. This is a large piece, uh, which really shows itself off. Colors are vivid. So yes, I are. think that's a nice point too. It is. It's kind of like a deep cranberry type of a red, mm -hmm. um, almost more of a brownish kind of red. Then you have the goldish color, the soft green that's mm -hmm. there. Um, but then they're all sponged over with other colors, which yeah, is really exactly. pretty. It just makes it such a, a beautiful piece. It's so artistic. Like I said, it just really reminds me of one of those pieces that I'd see at that jury craft show, or yes. if you went to like the Philadelphia Flower Show. Yes. This is the kind of thing you'd find. You'd see. Yep. Um, it's it's something that. All also, like if you're if you're growing a family, maybe someone is having a baby and they're just starting their family tree. Yeah, I love this as an idea to have them in their family room area oh. or whatever, and then you put some maybe family photos. Maybe you're someone that collects antique photos of your family, and you.
you want this to kind of be the centerpiece and then put those nice. photos around yeah. in your dining room or somewhere. It just kind of lends itself to so much, but it's just so artistic on itself. And whether or not you're going to use it inside, we've kind of talked a lot of inside areas. You can use it outside. Yes. Put it on that she shed, put it on the back of your home, wherever you would like to have something that you're seeing that's really beautiful, especially if you don't have the opportunity to grow a lot of trees or yes. greenery. This is kind of a nice option. I don't know if you can see, but kind of over behind Katie, it looks you know, great we have it there. over there too. So, I mean, you know, again, look at those spots yeah. around your house, you know, your outside area, your sunroom in between French doors. Um, I just think that's so pretty. It's a nice background for you today, Katie. Well, I like it. You know, and it's funny, Nancy, right before you said what you said, I wrote it on in our Facebook chat. I would love to have this on a big wall surrounded by family photographs. Oh my gosh, I, I just, your mind. Because I look at, for, mm -hmm. especially from a distance, when you look at it, I see family tree. And yeah. I just think what a beautiful centerpiece to then just splay out all the pictures of our loved ones. I want to call out too, if you look how we lifestyled it over by you, Katie, mm -hmm. great we with use those. those red lanterns it from Martha awesome. Stewart. Mm -hmm. So those, that, yeah, those lanterns, away. I feel like are like, if you're trying to figure out, okay, I want to put it on over my mantle, but then what else do I put there? Those red lanterns are gorgeous with that. It's They're a very, really very nice. close to the red that's in the tree. Mm -hmm. Very similar It's colors. a nice match. Yeah. Um, we're going to wrap up on this. Customer top rated from Plow and Hearth. Get yours, reserve yours, get this preseason price because the Regular QVC price is over $61. We have it for under $50 with Easy Pay, and that is item number M58109. We have another item from Plow and Hearth um, that Nancy's going to stick around for. And if you have any questions about those Martha Stewart lanterns, you guys, that are on six easy payments, free shipping, all of that, um, ask Katie over 